first, why do we use radiation for cancer treatments? What is radiation? Well, radiation is an x-ray beam. Now, you've all had x-rays before. You've had CT scans. The x-rays go right through you. You don't see them. You don't feel them. The difference is these are very high-powered x-rays, and they're generated by a very fancy, very expensive machine. And what happens is you're laying on a table, and the head of the machine zaps you this way. And so what happens is the radiation, the x-rays, come out of the head of the machine, and they go through the air. And there's nothing really in the air for them to interact with, so they don't do much. But then they finally hit you. And ultimately, you're just a big bag of water. So the radiation x-rays knock electrons off your water molecules. They bounce around inside your cells, and that ultimately leads to DNA damage. Now, why that's important is because DNA, uh, cancer started off as a normal cell and was doing everything it was supposed to do. And then it decided to change and stop listening to everything else, and all it wants to do is grow and divide. But before a cell can do that, it always has to copy its DNA. So the idea is if the cancer cell tries to copy its DNA and there's too much damage, it can't copy it. And then when it tries to divide, it dies. Now, your normal tissues don't like to divide as much and have a much better DNA repair mechanism. So what we do is we take the total dose of radiation and we divide it up into smaller daily treatments. And what that does is that allows your normal tissues time to repair themselves while still giving the cancer enough DNA damage to ultimately kill it.